Hi guys, so today I've got a juice review for you. I've got three juices and I've got a little blurb thing here. They're from South Coast Clouds and I will just give you, I don't want you to see everything in my letter obviously, but I'll just so show you their social media part, so, um, because I'm not allowed to put links. So there we go guys. So pause it there if you want any information about them. <clears throat> I'd like to thank South, Clo South Coast Clouds for actually getting in touch with me for the purpose of this review and asking me to do these juices. So they have three juices they've sent me and these are a 3070, so it's a um, PG ba VG base as usual, so it's 3070. So the first one we've got is the South Coast Clouds CD Black Ice. There it is. Oh, I'm knocking everything off my desk, so excuse me. CD Black Ice. So what's it say about it? It says CD Black Ice is a classic black currant menthol, anise done to our standards. A massive, flavorful black currant backed up with cooling exhale and a subtle aftertaste of anise. Making sure we keep this one juicy with the priority of black currant on its own can be very di drying. This is quite an intense flavour, so we suggest starting with low power for this flavour and increasing it to find a suitable level that fits your personal preference. So that's good that they've actually said that about that, guys, letting you know to start it on a cooler flavour so, um, setting. But first of all, let's have a wee snifty. Definitely getting the black currant there. Let's have a taste. Wow, well, getting that black currant with that anise, that menthol, almost like um, I don't know, <clears throat> tunes. Maybe it sounds like I could do with something like that with my throat being as it is at the moment. Um, but I assure you, I've not got a cough or cold. It's just I've been dealing with my parrots. So I'm going to actually change my wattage for this one. I'm going to start off low. So let's turn this down to I don't know forty. Oops, gone too far now, guys. So we'll start this one at 40, no point this, that, and over, just dead on 40. So I've got the Puma Wasp on top, there you can see, 40 watts. Coil coming out at 0 0.35. Sizzle, oh that is low look, Oof, sizzle, sizzle. I get the coolness straight away. There is the cold exhale, but the corners in inhale with the black current. Let's whack this up a little bit. We'll go to 50 this time. Now, everyone knows with me suffering asthma and that, um, anything that's too cool, got too much cool ardor in that, does set me coughing. There you go. So you can see I'm at 50. So that's going to focus in for you. There we go, 50. Again, you are getting that coolness, that menthol almost feeling. <coughs> Damn, making me cough there. <coughs> I'm not getting the black currant as much as I'd like. We'll put it up a bit further now. Obviously, we'll go 55 because obviously it's starting to make me cough now. Yep, so I'm turning around. My phone is buzzing away. Let me turn that the sound off a minute if I can. There we go, so we don't annoy us. Yep, 55. 
again you've got that coolness there's the menthol there is the black currant but the black currant is very subtle we'll try it 60 now that's my preferred vape using these mods another drip sizzle again you've got that coolness you have now got more of the black currant there I won't say this is a synthetic one again taste is subjective guys so always remember that when you look at juice reviews yeah I mean it's not one I could vape all the time again because of that coolness that iciness because that would trigger me with my coughing fits but I can get that black currant flavour there with the iciness it's just I don't like icy vapes or cold vapes so there we go so there's that one so the second one we're going to look at is grubby ice and the info for that is grubby ice is a unique blend cons cons oh, let me get pick it up as it constituting of a bubble gum heavy base backed up with undertones of grape and cherry and a chilled exhale so it's another chilled one guys again bubble gum can be very dry a very drying flavor so again the priority was to keep it juicy no things about saying start low or anything like that so let's have a wee snifty of the grubby ice straight away i've got that the aroma of bubble gum and i love that i love that aroma because it just takes me back to my childhood days let's put a wee taste on have a lick test yep i can actually taste that as well so puma wasp on top 60 watts the water go this time at 0 0.34 sizzle again it does have that coolness and the bubble gum's there and it's not a strong taste very subtle personally i would have liked to have more bubble gum taste and less ice but again taste is subjective guys so the last one we've got is um south coast clouds it's a fruity limon so the fruity limon is a fruity limon is a tangy still lemonade with background hints of summer fruits since developing this flavor we have found the more power you put into it the more changeable the flavor can become offering a sweet lemon inhale an exhale of lingering summer fruits and a lemony aftertaste and these are their new brands so let's have a go at this one so this is like i say the fruity lime on and there it is you do get that hint of a lemon there let's have a lick test tasty wow Ooh. you do get that sort of sourness from a light from a lemon as such straight away so we've got a puma wasp on top 60 watts cork coming out at 0 0.35 sizzle you are getting that lemon that lemony taste mix of fruits at the moment this one's not grabbing me let's whack this up a bit because they said if you alter it the higher you go so we'll try it at 70 i don't want to there we go so we'll try it 70. i'm getting it there now i like fruits this one is just not getting me still 
Let's go again higher. Um, shall we try 80? Oh, it's gone too low there. Oh, it's gone too high. Can't make my mind of what I'm doing here. Here we go. So let's go 80. Put a bit more in. No, it's just not doing it for me. The, the flavours are there. It's not horrible or synthetic or anything. It's just not one that I would enjoy using. It just doesn't grab me enough for the fruits. But that doesn't mean it wouldn't for yourselves. Like I say, flavour is subjective and taste is. So that's it, guys. That's it for me. So remember, guys, mama knows best. Vape, don't smoke. I love you much, Lee. And don't forget, if you go down below, you'll find in my description all my social medias, my Teespring and Patreon. And remember, I do giveaways. I do all my juices that are reviews of these. Even though you've just seen, I only put a tiny bit on. They'll be taped up. And some lucky person will get all this set as well. I do give it all away, but you must be a Patreon to get it. And that's from $3. That's all, as little as $3. So that's it, guys. So um, I'll catch you on the next one. Love you much, see. Bye.